So when we're talking about the upper structure triads, upper structure, meaning you take the same chord, structure it above the lower chord, and you've got this sound. And so the Charleston can be played more in a straight way. Charleston, 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 Charleston. I mean, I, I could still dance to that myself, and I think, I think we all could. And I think it's better than the other one, which I won't play because I don't like the syncopations. And use your upper structure triads. Charleston, Charleston, Charleston. I want to get back to Maiden Voyage. Now, when uh, Mr. Hancock writes, F sus, sus of course means sustain, uh, sus for. I suppose this is a mysterious thing about this. I, 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 I believe that he meant sustain for, and you decide how long. So in the beginning we have D sustaining. For however long you want then. And then he makes a very interesting jump here. Sustain for, oh, maybe that long. And back to the beginning. When accompanying a singer, never, never, never listen to them. They must listen to you. It is not a two-way street. It is a one-way street. You came in like a wrecking ball. I never hit so hard in love. All I wanted, all I wanted, I have a hard time with this line. All I wanted was to break your walls. Almost sounds like she's going to say something else there. All you did was wreck me. So we have the diminished, yes. But in this later part of the series, we deal with more uh, uh, difficult subjects, the double diminished. That leads me to the drop two uh, concept. Uh, you've probably seen this in many uh, uh, books. Uh, we take a simple triad, tri meaning three, like a tricycle or, or, or uh, well, just those two. And then we take the, the triad and we drop two out. Take the top and the middle and we're left with and now the passing chord. We try it on Sweet Georgia Brown. Pass it to the left hand. Pass it to the right hand. Ah, shice. Sometimes melodies just come to me. If, you, if you're not feeling inspired, uh, go outside in the, in the, in the open space with your, with your piano and play anything that comes to your mind. This is unplanned. So that just came to me. So you need to know not just the, the piano part, but all of the sound. You need to know the board, the soundboard for your own concert. You need to test the microphones. <laughs> I don't think this one is on. This one, huh? Oh, it's a light. But uh, all the buttons, the blue buttons, the red buttons, the gray buttons, the green buttons, the white buttons, uh, all the slidings. But the, notice the difference now. And now, not so good, yes? And then, crossed hands. Can you, can you actually come down and, nope, that, not that time. Nope, nope, here we go. And, I'm working on this too, but it's, the cross hands gives you a completely different sound. Play it for me again, Jake, try it. Nine! Nine, Jake, nine! Yes, the nine!
Yeah! 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 You turn around at the end of the, at the end of the uh, coda. Turn around.